impactful earthquake has sent shockwaves across the East Asian nations of Taiwan, Japan and Philippines. Several buildings collapsed in Hualien after Taiwan was rocked by a 7.5 magnitude earthquake, triggering authorities to issue tsunami warning for coastal areas. Now, both Japan and Philippines also issued similar tsunami warnings with Japan's Okinawa airport suspending operations. This after the nation claimed that the first wave of tsunami has hit two of its southern islands. Japan has also issued an evacuation warning for coastal areas of Okinawa. Let's tell you that the seismology authority has called the earthquake the strongest to hit the nation in 25 years. My colleague Dipali joins me over the phone lines Dipali, we're also looking at the visuals on our screens right now. Absolutely distressing, to say the least. What is the latest that we know in terms of the on-ground situation? Well, yes, Navedna, according to officials, it is the strongest uh, earthquake in the last uh, 25 years, rather. And if I talk when at, it struck at around 7.58 a.m. local time, then the impact is, has been the strongest in South Taiwan. But the entire island has suffered a jolt, like we can see on our screen, the visuals are over there. The pictures have, are now emerging, showing how, uh, what is the level of destruction, rather. Many buildings have collapsed, including in their capital city of Taipei. One person has so far been killed and over 50 have been injured. But let's remember that these are only the uh, initial numbers. Train services have also been suspended uh, across uh, Taiwan. It has a population of about 23 million people. So that is coming uh, as a major inconvenience now. And Philippines, like you said, has also issued a tsunami warning. If I talk about Taiwan, that's correct. Uh, Okinawa has issued an evacuation warning. It is the southernmost island of Japan, rather one of the southernmost islands of Japan. And it is actually uh, closer to Taiwan than uh, it is to Tokyo. Hence, uh, the impact is majorly felt over there. So flight operations have also been suspended in uh, Okinawa. And uh, a tsunami warning has also been issued. And uh, two, two of its southern islands have already been hit by tsunami waves. We know how Japan, uh, you know, is one of the most uh, seismically active countries. And it accounts for rather one, uh, one fifth of the world earthquakes of magnitude six or greater. Memories from March 2011 uh, tragedy are still alive. But like I said, after aftershocks are still expected, only initial pictures of damage are coming up now. Uh, we can only hope and pray for everybody's safety over there. Back to you. Absolutely, the Pali. appreciate you getting us those details. And like you rightly pointed out, one can only uh, hope and imagine uh, how distressing this is. And one can only pray for the situation to get better. Let's leave it at 